today, and that is that one of Sarasota's Republican-held state legislative seats now belongs to the Democrats. Margaret Good defeating Congressman Vern Buchanan's son, Republican James Buchanan, in the race for State House District 72. ABC 7's Jess Dowdrick joins us now to explain what this could mean for the local Republican and Democratic parties. Jacqueline Scott, a majority of District 72 residents are registered Republicans, so this was a surprising upset for the party. Nonetheless, the victor, Margaret Good, is already in Tallahassee, hitting the ground running. Congratulations and welcome to the Florida House. After an exciting victory here at home Tuesday night, State Representative Margaret Good drove to Tallahassee early Wednesday morning to start serving District 72. <laughs> Good defeated her Republican opponent, James Buchanan, by seven percentage points in a Republican-dominated district. There are more than 122,000 voters in District 72. A majority, 42 percent of them, Republicans. Only 32 percent Democrats, leaving a surprising 25 percent of voters as other. All parties were well represented at the polls. 36 percent of the registered voters showed up to vote. It's likely that we had more turnout than any special state house election in recent history and possibly most other special elections in Florida. Here's the breakdown by party. As you can see, the majority of voters were Republicans, nearly half of the 44,000 voters. But still, good came out victorious. It says the Democrats were highly energized, but there's no way that you can get that that margin unless Margaret Good uh, takes a nice chunk of the NPA voters uh, and perhaps more importantly, there were significant amounts of Republicans that crossed over and voted for Margaret Good. There's the only way that we can end up with the results uh, that we ended up with. The nation's eyes are on this victory as this is the 36th time a GOP held state legislative seat has changed parties since President Trump took office. Trump's base remains energized, uh, but beyond his base, he might be losing uh, a lot of the more uh, tepid uh, supporters. He, he did that. That's what happened in this district, HD 72. Good is stepping into her role halfway through the legislative session. The session runs through March 9th. Jacqueline Scott.